Hey, it's Consumer Will. It's 5.30 in the morning. And uh, <laughs> I had a bit of a brain fart, so I'm going to kind of run with it here. Um, I've been following this thread here uh, on RC groups called the IOM Do-It-Yourself Design. Um, it started by uh, Porky Pig, who's a guy on the island. Great guy, lots of experience, been racing IOM for a long time. And, um, you know, he, he, they're building wooden IOMs uh, to be very, very competitive. Um, anyways, uh, I'm building one too right now. Uh, not a wooden one, but uh, it's my first IOM. So, um, uh, so we're kind of putting all the parts together. And, um, uh, you know, we just started looking at uh, the, the foil profiles. And um, they're very uh, backlogged right now, and you're looking four to six weeks, and we're hoping to kind of get our boats ready in time for uh, the beaver fever. Uh, and if not, there's a, uh, another one in uh, June. So um, I was thinking, well, geez, you know, I'm looking at this pad of things, and there's an old thing back in the hockey card days where you can bring up the por almost 3D, the effect of... Uh, a card by basically getting like four or five cards and cutting it off a little bit of time to kind of create those uh, leg profiles or hand profiles as they're kind of coming out at you. So I'm looking at this and I'm like, you know, that's about five mil there if you had um, them all stacked up. So what if you had some paper and you cut down the profile just a little bit at a time to create that 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 camber that that foil effect? on a fin or rudder. So anyways, this is part one of my, my build, but what basically what I'm doing is uh, just to experiment, I've got a 1 16th piece of balsa wood here and um, I've effectively cut out uh, pieces of graph paper and I've decreased it by, you know, one or two squares at a time. And um, I figured that if we can stack them all together, um, we can create a, uh, a foil profile out of it and it would be consistent uh, to doing it on both sides of the fin and um, you know you can control how much uh, how much shape you put to it by number of pieces as well as uh, um, as well as uh, you know the the foil itself. So, anyways, this is part one of my videos. I'm gonna um, I'm gonna test this out. Uh, I'm just gonna slap it together. I'm gonna uh, put some fiberglass over it and um, sand it down and see what it looks like. And of course, I want to see how strong it is too as well. So, um, stay tuned. Uh, subscribe. I'm gonna be uh, posting some more. Okay, cheers, guys.